God spoke to me a couple of times before we started church. He called me by name, Howard, and it came right from here, his voice. I was 10 years old and uh, dad had gone to Illinois District Camp that summer of 73 and came home and told my mom and us that he felt it was the will of God to start the church in Troy. We had done no preparation. We just had a house and we went home and started church in my front room. Early on, it wasn't a church that was populated with a nuclear type family. You know, it was people that were in care homes. It was children coming on buses. So it was, it was quite a unique you know, feeling early on. He kept us in that storefront building for 16 years. We had many things happen. It is still considered a farming community, so everybody, it's kind of laid back. It's more of a relaxed community. When you walk into the Pentecostals of Troy, I think you're gonna find a place that's very welcoming. Um, you're gonna find a group of people that have genuine love for souls. We started Celebrate Recovery to help people overcome their addictions. Making it easier for people who have no experience. I voluntarily submit to any and all changes God wants to make in my life. With a church to come in and feel welcome. He was able to, to teach me to love myself, being a better husband, a better father, a better co-worker. Whatever um, you're looking for, you're going to find it here in the Pentecostals of Troy. I've often said from the pulpit, we're not here to build an empire in Troy. We're here to build the kingdom of God. And as time goes by, I see more and more how important it is to have the truth. The truth is what makes us free. Used to be God was everything, but now you have so many other options to keep you occupied. I was my own worst enemy. 90% of things that was happening to me that was causing me problems or heartache was myself. God, all he needs is a willing mind. He's there, he's waiting. He'll help you make the change. We have a message that God wants the world to hear the importance of baptism in Jesus' name. The importance of attending church, the importance of God being first in your life, whether it's at home, on the job, or at church. And we need to stay being a one God apostolic movement because we are different and He wants that.